This is our second variant that we've got here at AUSA 2016. This is our variant for the Army's GMV requirement, which requires a nine man, nine soldiers seated in one vehicle, secondary and primary rollover protection, be able to be high hot, sir, high hot lifted and internally transportable in the CH-47. This vehicle is a direct derivative, a direct variant of our SOCOM program. Uh, for the SOCOM program, we had a seven seat configuration for, for the SOCOM variant. And what we've done is we've taken the seven seat configuration, we've optimized it for this Army requirement, which is two more seats with, a, with a com, the combat comm system removed. Additional requirement for the Army is to have a two liter system that's located on the truck that you can be able to take your seats out and replace those with two litters to be patient transported, which is what you see here. Additionally, as part of our GMV variant for, for the Army, this is the four seats that make up our nine seat kit. So what we do is we take these four seats, we remove the secondary leader system out of the vehicle. It's a bolt-on, bolt-out configuration. So the operator can take his, his BII, his basic issue items, he can remove these litters and bolt in the seats however he feels that he needs to operate. And again, bolt on, bolt off, it takes about 30, minutes to, about 30 minutes to get this kit out and to put the seats in and you're back to the nine man, nine man vehicle. As part of our crew protection for the vehicle, this roll cage system, secondary roll cage system, which meets all the FMVSS standards, was developed under our SOCOM program for 1.1. It provides protection for not only the litter patients, but also the seated patients. It does not need to be removed from the vehicle when you swap out configurations. It's a part of the vehicle. It's also bolt on, bolt off. Whether you have your four guys in the back or two litter patients, they're both under the, under the cover of the roll cage.